Hey, hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Miyogi. Welcome back to part 6 of our initial The Extreme Stage Let's Play. Um, where we left off the, in the last episode, um, we were treated to some Red Bull. The good and the bad kind. <laughs> anyway, so now, um, as per the last visit, we're actually um, being greeted by Todo Juku, or aka Todo Racing School. They'll be, we'll be facing off against Daiki Ninomiya. Another character who shares a synonymous name to that of one of my main characters, don't ask why, if it's either inspiration from them or just pure sheer coincidence. <coughs> anyway. <laughs> Sorry, still get the flu. I'm in the cuffs. Anyway, so yeah, um, I did a couple of minor changes with my R34. You'll see them in a moment once the game loads. Remember before I had the uh, cup-sized um, spoon-style side mirrors? I kind of changed that. To what? Let's see in a bit. Sakai san, Koko de Hashter Togan o Kamisamate. Donna Renjunandeskane. Shachoga Mitako de Yukaranua. Canary no item and the Shokido. Hitoria Sakit on Soko Kai de Mitako to Arna. Shogi Kitata. いい気になった走り屋が other than earlier, that was the one minor dialogue change. I kind of lost track on what that was. Anyway, we'll check it out later. Take note, that aura is just for looks. It's not gonna help him at all. Take note, most um, Sukuba rivals, especially in the downhill, they'll always start off like that. Well, we only have three of them. Also, speaking of home course advantages on the last part, we'll abuse it on this area. Oh great, my R's going wild. I think it had too much Red Bull from the last episode. I better control this baby. Yeah, section 1, Daiki would go hard. Section 2, he would lapse so much. In the full tune, we're actually maxing out at 147 kilometers per hour. That would actually help us a lot. Yeah, no surprise. Nino Mi is actually gaining on us at the long straight. His V Tech is starting to kick in. Alright, now he's actually dropping off at that section. By the way, that was the 10 uh, consecutive snake hairpins. Normally known as the part where Fujiwara instigated a blind attack on one of the routes against Toshia Joshima.
番で余計な負担をタイヤにかけてしまった今にしてみればとんでもないミスだったぜ Yeah, also, we can actually ride the gutters on the side. I really actually do the uphill more on Sukuba back when I was doing it on the arcade. Saw my no break bat battles on my video list. If you haven't, do check them out. Okay, that takes care of one um, godly um, rival on Tsukuba. By the way, it looks like in hard difficulty, the auras actually make a purpose. I stand corrected. やられました。信じられねえぞ、大輝。あいつは、そんなに早いって言うのか。早いことは早いけど、それよりも信じられないほど来ればな戦略にやられた気がするんだ。気をつけてください、坂井さん。あいつ、早いだけじゃない。頭
We build up a huge cap from here and we're as much as possible try to hit 150 by the Oh yeah, GTR advantage, uh R34 advantage on Sukuba. 148 is the top speed but prior to gear three. Ah uh, gear six. What am I saying? It's the only one that can actually hit that top speed. Ow! I'm playing it actually the same way as how I played in the arcade. Almost! I actually break earlier in section 1. I can't believe my logic is actually working. No breaking on Sakuba Uphill is actually doing something good for me. <laughs> I would be surprised if I hit 3 s minutes flat just like my lap time in the arcade. Which I can never do it even on the ouch. I got Red Bulled again. Yeah, screw it, I can't. But still, 97 gap against Sakai is uh, kind of a good feat, I think. Sells up against Sakai. You know, I may plan to actually do something extra special for you guys. We'll go back to the senior citizens after the next part. Yeah, uh, this let's play is quite short, so I'll try to expand it as much as possible by going first to Hapogahara. ないてもみなかったぜ。まさか俺がトラップで逆にやられるなんて。東道塾の let me mention something about it being lucky. I beg to differ. 97 meters is not lucky, Sakai. 97 is not lucky. あんたは少しコレステロール減らさないと長生きできないよ。君はあの時のこうちゃん。知り合いかい。ああ。この間ちょっとな。なかなかいい走りをする若者だよ。こうちゃんがそこまで言うとは興味深いな。うん。どうやら嬢ちゃんに用があるみたいだぜ。おお。
after we finish Hapugahara again. So, this is Miyogi saying see you guys in the next parts.